Hey guys, it's Beer O'Clock on Ginger Beer and today we are reviewing this. It is a Brewdog beer, it is their Hazy Jane New England IPA, 330ml bottle, coming in at 7.2%. Happy days, happy days. There's the design, the usual Brewdog design. And there's the bottle top as well. Brewdog obviously now done all in Scotland. They've got two plants up in Scotland. One that they deal with their normal beer and the other plant they've got just deals with the sour beers they do. Not the biggest fan of Brewdog beers, I must admit. Just, just my opinion. But Hazy Jane is one that I think they've got right. Fantastic beer. Haven't had it for a while. I think they may... I'm not sure one of them they've tweaked the recipe and it may be that I haven't had it since that's been done. I can't remember if it's this one or not. But anyway, let's get it out of the bottle and into the glass. Mm -hmm. There you go, S slight smoking on it. Managed to get the bottle top into one of the empty glasses I've got. That was a good shot. Right, let's get it in. Right, there we go, there we go. So, as you can see, a one to one and a half finger head on the top, uh, the body, as you expect with a New England IPA, almost looking like a mango juice, looking like a breakfast juice. That's how it should be. Nice and heavy and hazy, a nice straw sort of color there, yellowish thick as anything can't see any way through it we've got carbonation light carbonation moving up the side of the glass and the head is still staying where it is let's see what it's like on the nose oh wow ho, ho, ho. i'm getting pineapple through on that it smells like it smells like a glass of juice at breakfast it really does i've got the pineapple coming through the zesty lemon and lime uh, there's a little bit of pine there as well sort of forest freshness uh, the hops you can you get a sort of twinge of the hops on your nose oh that is just that's incredible that's oh, lovely lovely this one i've taken straight out of the fridge it's one of those that i i think again you've got to drink it cold it's no good drinking it at room temperature um and it's it's much better. Let's see what it's like in the in the mouth now. Cheers, everybody. Oh, I'm going in again. Absolutely intense fruit there. The hops, the hops are pushing straight up through. The mat has got a great mouthfeel. The carbonation is pushing it round and round in the mouth. The side of the tongue is getting a hitting from a hit from it. I'm getting the pineapple. I'm getting the like I said before, the sort of lemon zesty lemon through. The hops are just incredible. Oh, that really is. Absolutely incredible. So that's, do you know, tip top tastic. That's what that is, guys. Brewdog, fantastic. That is, it's Brewdog's Hazy Jane coming in at 7.2, and that. That is a cracking beer. The, the guys, the two guys up at Brewdog, I reckon they've got that spot on. That is beautiful. I don't think you could do too many of them of an evening with the strength of it, but I'd enjoy a few of those. Oh, that just, guys, you've got to try that. This one is another, yet another one that I've picked up from Tesco's. It was in there, three bottles for £5.25 range, I think it was. 
and it's certainly worth finding out that for a New England IPA, if you haven't tried a New England IPA before, then they should be like this. I think I did one earlier in the week. Uh, I can't think which one it was, and it was clear it was it was almost looking like just like a pale ale. That's wrong. It should be like this. It should look like a fruit juice. It should look like it belongs on the breakfast table. It should smell and taste exactly like this. Brewdog, well done, sir. Well done. That is excellent. That is a tip top tastic beer. Try and find it if you can, guys. Fantastic. Hazy Jane, enjoy. As usual, hit the subscribe button at the bottom and you'll be you'll find out every time that I uh, do a new update hit the bell and it will let you know when I'm doing one uh, and find my Facebook page which is under ginger beer drop me a line tell me what you're drinking uh, suggest some beers anything like that and I will try and come back to you I've had a few people come come through to me and I have tried to go back if I've missed you apologize drop me another line remind me and I will try and get back to your work pending uh, also find me on Instagram uh, which is ginger underscore beer 041 and where I try and keep up to date with putting pictures on of beers that I've got that are ready for reviewing and where I'm drinking and things like that guys as usual thanks so so much have a great weekend and I'll see you all soon cheers Oh, so zesty. Lovely, lovely.